What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Today we have another Willie Pete's chocolate bar to review. This is from WillyPeetsChocolates.com out of Harwinton, Connecticut. It is a veteran owned company. It's made in Connecticut. There's the website there. And as always, the veteran crisis line. Seriously, if you need help, call. That's, if you need help, just call. That's all I can say. Can't speak from experience. I can't speak from experience of what veterans go through because I've never been in the military. But you know, if you need help, give it a call. <clears throat> anyway, with that said, today's chocolate bar is the Fun V, white chocolate with Oreo crumbs and habanero peppers. And on the scale from no heat to danger, it is very hot. It's right just, just past halfway <clears throat> on the scale. So, should be pretty good. Should have some nice heat. Now, the ingredients are sugar, partially hydrated palm kernel and cottonseed oils, non-fat dry milk, cocoa processed with alkali, cocoa, um, Glycerol lactoesters of fatty acids. I don't even want to know what that is. Soy lecithin and salt. Unbleached enriched flour, which is wheat flour, niacin, reduced iron, thiamine mono nitrate, which is your vitamin B1, riboflavin, which is B12, and folic acid. And then you have sugar, palm, and or canola oil. Cocoa, processed with alkali again. Been there like twice, but anyway. High fructose corn syrup, leavening, which is baking soda and or calcium phosphate, salt, soy lecithin, chocolate, artificial flavor. It contains milk, wheat, and soy and habanero peppers. White chocolate with, oh, okay. I was trying to figure out why all that flour, yeah, the Oreos, okay. I don't claim to know what I'm doing. People just assume I do. Anyway, we're going to get into this chocolate bar if I can open it up. If I can open it up. I don't want to destroy the labels. There we go. All right. Let's see what this looks like together. Oh yeah, baby. People could say white chocolate's not chocolate. It's called white chocolate. That's what it is. Whatever. Oh man, it smells so good. It kind of smells like the old Nestle's cookies and cream. I don't know if they even still make those bars. Nestle does, but I remember getting those at a uh, convenience store in town when I was younger. Look at that. Look at that piece of Oreo there. Good Lord. Look at that piece of Oreo. This is going to be a good bar. And I don't like Oreos, but um, I'll take it back. I did try their what was it? Java, Java chip or whatever it is. That was a good Oreo. And I don't like Oreos, so you know it had to be good if I like. But anyway. So it looks like. And here we go from Willie Pete's at the Fun V Bar. White chocolate with Oreo crumbs and habanero peppers. Cheers. A little soft because it's warm out here. Mmm. The chocolate is so good. Mmm. Wow. It's not really overly sweet either, which I like. Even though the first ingredient is sugar. And a little bit of the habanero heat now. That's hit me right here <clears throat> where that ghost pepper chocolate hit me. Man, is this good. One more little piece. Mm. 
That's good. The heat on that, <clears throat> I'll give it about two to two and a half. Flavor, seven and a half out of ten. That's a delicious bar. You order from Willie Pete's, or better yet, order from Willie Pete's and order this bar because this bar is absolutely amazing. That's very good. The Fun V with chocolate. The Fun V, white chocolate with Oreo crumbs and habanero pepper. Give it a try. So with that said, I hope you enjoyed this review. See you next time.